Hi, Pisces, gang, gang, gang. You already know what it is. It's your girl, Empress777, here today with your almost daily love reading. And for a treat today, guys, first of all, I'm gonna tell y'all how I played myself earlier today, but let me just do this real quick. Okay, holy angels and spirit, guys. Give me clear, concise messages for my Pisces family. This is gonna be for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. It may or may not resonate. It is general, guys, right? So take what resonates, leave the rest, keep an open mind, open heart cross watchers put yourself where you belong for story okay so got a bit of a different scene today guys so i was definitely feeling intuitively to do a read outside a very freeing type of energy i feel like some of y'all got the fuck out of dodge somebody definitely definitely had you bent bent twisted fucked up whatever your phrase is okay totally messed up okay they was off they rocker okay i don't even use that phrase <laughs> this person is crazy as fuck everything that you a pisces a pisces me i'm going to chase you i'm gonna chase you hmm hmm okay so this is somebody who definitely should have a long time ago been off to see the wizard they need a fucking brain okay if only they had one this definitely wouldn't have been a thought i mean this would have been far from the thought this is somebody who thought you would chase them guys very very self-centered conceited person um you did get this person a time of day though we just gotta say that you know you know what I'm saying? i keep it a book i keep it a book um in any case i feel like you definitely dodged a bullet okay this was not like your average pistol this wasn't no pistol y'all this wasn't no little pistol starter this was a motherfucking ak okay it's ak-47 okay this is some shit that was really detrimental to your spirit at some point in time you had to get your life though you had to come to your senses and realize that shit was never going to change that this person just was not good for you that's just how it goes right everybody can't be for everybody that don't make no sense bitch. what are you talking about look Everyone has at one point in time been toxic to another person. This one just so happened to be extremely toxic to you, okay? I also got this card. So these are cards that popped out. I wasn't even going to take them, but they told me intuitively I needed to. Um, guys, I've had a time trying to find a location to, to do a read for you guys today. Um, as you can see, like I said, we have a bit of a different location. This is my balcony, by the way. I was gonna try to do it in our Sky Lounge, um, but everybody and their mama decided that they wanted to be fucking nosy today, okay? Too much energy, too much, you know, people in my face like get out of my face don't worry about what i'm doing worry about you you know what i'm saying i'm trying to get a message to my piscians you know if you don't know me then you don't know right like i don't advertise this channel guys if you find me then you find me intuitively we are soul family we find each other um we get new subscribers by the way now that we mentioned that right great segue please click that subscribe button guys i upload for you guys quite often click the notification bell and click the like button if you've already done all of the above that is the way that we support the channel okay so you are protected okay everything that has transpired is definitely divinely guided so please stop beating yourself up no more conversations no more negative self-talk about what woulda coulda shoulda um about you know just what you allowed to transpire i understand the whole taking accountability thing but please understand that you were dealing with someone who is not well they are not well mentally mentally they are not well we just decided that right we said that they should have gone to see the wizard you know what i'm saying they need to be down the yellow brick road okay but instead they're waiting for you to kind of chase behind them guys <laughs> Ugh, why i don't want this headache i'll tell you you like girl we don't want this fucking headache either can we do something else no we can't okay so the reason why i felt intuitively i think to do your read outside is because you are free you freed yourself from these feelings of toxicity this was a very poisonous person guys I have to be very clear okay i have to be very honest this is somebody who was poisonous to your psyche they were poisonous to your your soul and shit right this is this may be somebody who wanted your soul i don't know i don't know i don't know i don't know why i heard that i don't know i don't know just take that if it resonates definitely not somebody who meant you well okay and i'm so sorry that you've had to deal with this but you are on your way you know what i'm saying you be on your way and you are definitely protected by the divine and spirit this is definitely something that has had to happen because of the um cycle that you are now entering i do feel a cycle of freedom abundance groundedness stability true happiness fulfillment whatever that might be for you right everybody's happiness looks different the recipe will be different for each of us okay so that's what i have gotten let's go ahead and dig a little bit deeper here see what we got 
so in any case i was trying to take you guys to the sky lounge here and people just kept interrupting mad loud people want to have parties and shit i'm like can y'all get the fuck out i know y'all pay rent here and everything but i need it like i need this and spirit was like no this is not it <laughs> this is not it sis this is not working got people kids coming up to me like what is she doing can you get your fucking kids though you know what I'm saying? i don't fool with people kids especially kids that i can't tell what to do then you can't be in my hemisphere you know what i'm saying if i can't tell you to stop touching my shit you please 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 find your mama find your daddy okay so anyway here we are okay this is my um this is my balcony right so it'll work um i definitely feel good energy here guys okay Ooh, yeah so we have crescent moon okay there, it does say feminine power now even if you are a man or a masculine um the feminine energy we both have that within us right all humans we both have masculine and feminine energy feminine energy is a signifier of yin that means it don't move you don't need to move you've already done the work you can stay poised stay up on your throne don't move a muscle do not fucking move okay because everything that you've already put in all of the seeds that you've already planted are on their way back into you you don't need to do anything else do you understand <laughs> now your person would have a different say about that guys okay they definitely thought that you would have been on hot pursuit chasing that ass now i don't know y'all please tell me down in the comments is this something that you've done before i just don't know what would give them the inclination that this is something that would ever happen why do they think this from a piscean at that now look guys I like to think that I know you guys' energy quite well, quite well, quite well. We won't get into detail about that, but I ride for y'all. I'm a rider. So even I know that that, that is never going to be the case. That is never the case. You will, you will much rather eat a jean jacket. You know what I'm saying? You will much rather be the fuck alone and to chase somebody. Look, you look at people walking away or people removing themselves as like... <laughs> rejection is god's protection you know what i'm saying as like a favor you know as like somebody giving you an invitation to do some more shit that you like do um etc etc okay you look at it as more of a benefit okay or you can do that now i don't know if you were able to quite look at it like that in the um in the past okay all right so progress this is what we're making we're making progress we have our feminine energy going male or female gender doesn't matter just just means that you are not moving you are unmovable you are unshakable this could definitely be in reference to just your energy overall not necessarily just um in relationships you just may be uh, extremely unshakable in reference to what your thought processes are at this time you certainly know where it is that you want to go where you're going um and so you're just staying steadfast to the course you're not letting people sway you in every other which way okay it also says birth so some of you have gone through a spiritual awakening or a rebirth if you will so you're not even the same kind of person um if you did chase this person in the past I don't think that it was necessarily a chase. It may have been like a checkup, right? Like just, are you okay? Are you well? Are you alive? Are you breathing? Like you good? Like <clears throat> this is why they would be expecting this. That's not for everybody. Just take that how it resonates. They viewed it as a chase, but it certainly was far, far, very far from that. Okay. Um, we've already established though that they are brainless right they don't really think logically like you and i so this is why they would think that the hot pursuit would be the chase is on you know what i'm saying if the two of you got into a disagreement they're waiting for you to approach them they're waiting for you to come back they're waiting for you to, to see about them what they're doing what they who they with who, who they fucking who they talking to what it is that they need what it is that they want you know yikes we have cosmic moon so it says yeah <laughs> expansive growing and shining now let me tell you this is going to rub this person the wrong way you oh i don't know going on with your life without them this is not somebody who feels like you're able to do that and i do not know why y'all i'm confused i'm confused i'm confused is it that they're confused like what's going on here can somebody explain this to me why would they think that the world stops because of them this is a very arrogant person guys very very arrogant i don't know what it is about them that did it for you but they oh. 
Oh, spirit is not playing with us today, y'all. I gotta get the fuck out of this darkness. These bugs are gonna eat my ass up. What in the entire fuck? Okay, y'all, I get it. I get it. You know, look, look, I don't pass no judgment. We keep it real on this channel. If this is your story, then you already know, because I was definitely confused. I couldn't understand. Why would they ever, first of all, how did they last this long? You know what I'm saying? I know your energy, but here's the thing. Even if you did check up on them, which what is what it was, it was a checkup. They viewed it as chasing and it's never going to happen again. So yikes. This is why they are offended to the highest positivity. They are offended, guys. <laughs> They're offended. Okay. This is somebody who thinks that you're their person. I think that this may be the thoughts that are running through their head once they realize that the turnaround is that you're not, you're not. You're not turning the block no more. You know what I'm saying? Like, you're really fucking out of dodge. Like, onward and upward is what I just heard. This is going to surprise them, guys. <sighs> I don't know. I'm still confused. I get it. I get it that this was your type of person. This was your type. They did it for you. Something about them. It was just something about them. But they're certainly going to be in for a rude awakening. This is all divine time. And this is something that they would have to experience, guys. I get the idea that this is not somebody who gets turned down. You know what I'm saying? They walk away from relationships. <laughs> yeah, they change the status of relationships. They don't get the, the relationship status changed on them and get left in the dark. Did you ghost them? <laughs> oh, my God. Wow. Look, all of you didn't. But they're surely going to feel that way when they don't hear from you again. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. It's going to be a lot of question marks, okay? Lots of questions. Lots of questions that will go unanswered. This could quite literally be their karma, guys. They deserve this. I just have to say that. You know what I'm saying? I know I like to getting out people ass, but it is what it is. You're going to have to lay in this, baby boy. Baby girl. Baby girl. Baby girl. Baby boy. Ma'am, sir. Breast is. Sit your ass down. Please, lay in this shit that you created, please, okay? Ugh, they are not going to like that, guys. Get the idea that this is somebody who is quite immature, so they're not going to be able to handle this well. They don't handle rejection well. Rejection, what is that? They've never heard of it before in their life. Yikes. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, this is you. This is you, guys. This is you. And this is also why I felt the need to intuitively be out doors more grounded just kind of getting back to yourself getting your groove back getting back to the shit that you like to do never know mind you these motherfuckers who tried to come in and kind of fuck up the flow of your energy it's like forget that i'll count my l's and just move on right the way that i know um myself to be i don't deserve this shit right wow do not disturb so they now look guys this is general it either is your story or it's not whoever the story this is they will never hear from you again and that's just that on motherfucking that they're never going to hear from you again okay now spirit just say don't say never look listen to me listen to me I mean, i'm sorry breast this don't bank on it okay do not bank on it all right i'm just going to tell you that all right it's free will but I feel like if this is your story, please do not bank on ever hearing from this Piscean ever, 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 again. Okay. This shit don't move. Wow. You thought the Pisces doesn't move. You thought that they were going to stay around forever and ever. No, 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 no. Yikes. They play with it. Definitely somebody who thought your love was forever. They thought that, you know, things would just kind of go on forever. This is somebody who held themselves in a very, very high regard, guys. Did you prop them up on a pedal stool, Pisces? Do not lie to me. Do not lie to me. Do not lie to me. I love you. I love you. I love you like a fat kid little cake. Don't lie to me. Did you? Maybe you didn't know that you were doing it. But they definitely feel like you were somebody who kind of baked them up, gave them their props, told them that they were sexy, told them, you know, everything that they wanted to hear. It's not that you were doing it because you, you wanted to gas them, but they are certainly gassed to the max. Diesel. Oh. Wow. This is somebody who is entitled. They feel like they deserve a conversation. They feel like they 
they deserve to know what the fuck you're thinking they deserve to know what the hell is going on where do we go from here what is this going to be where are you what are you doing who are you fucking who are you saying do you still love me do you still want me wow <laughs> oh my gosh oh my gosh they're all up in their head guys and here's why this is a conceited person do you understand they definitely hold themselves they prop themselves on a pedestal and i feel like you may have reinforced that at some point in time please 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 let's just keep it let's keep it a buck okay at some point in time you may have reinforced their conceitedness you hate that you did that too you really want to tell them how you really feel you feel that that would be counterproductive for your growth, for for where you are now. You feel like that's going backwards. You know what I'm saying? This is why you have that do not disturb sign on. Yikes. Um, the thoughts will continue is what I just heard. They will be left to be stuck in their thoughts. Um, they will not get necessary answers. They left a lot of your concerns, a lot of your answers, your questions unanswered. Ooh, child, this is messy. <laughs> this is messy as fuck. <laughs> okay, so what's the most poignant energy in this person? Oh, I'm using the wrong deck. Hold on, guy. These bugs is being disrespectful. I don't like it. I'm about to start swinging. <laughs> I'm about to start swinging. All right, so where's this person's emotional state? currently Ooh. I'm sorry y'all I'm being silly let me be quiet before my neighbors call the cops shut up yeah I know I like to get hype <laughs> I couldn't keep y'all cooped up in our space this time though I just felt the need I was going to record in our, our normal space but it felt claustrophobic for some reason which I never feel it was like no get us out of here get me out of here get me out of here right yikes this might even be this person's energy, guys. You are free flowing, okay? Free as those waves, okay? Um, it's your territory. It is. This person. <laughs> oh boy. They definitely thought they caught them a big fish. The big shark. You know what I'm saying? And then they started to fuck with you. They they was really um confused. They was confused about how to ride waves, you know what I'm saying? And now they about to drown off your motherfucking wave. They really had you fucked up, y'all. I ain't even gonna lie. Um, their emotions are in and out, coming and going. They definitely thought that this hot pursuit of yours would be on way sooner than now. Way sooner than now. Yikes. can't make this shit up y'all you cannot this is your story this is your story and you love this shit you feel like they deserve it you feel like this person deserves it they fucked with the wrong one you are protected i don't know what they were thinking you guys they weren't thinking remember they don't have brain cells there's nothing there there's nothing air there's there's nothing air <laughs> there's nothing there but air do you understand i mean it is just bubbles and bullshit in their head oh my god ghosted blocked cut off it's not a lie guys some of you definitely ghosted this person for those of you who have ghosted this person the anxiety is so real they've never felt anything like this before in their life because not only did do they hold themselves in high regard and not only did you reinforce that at some point in time i'm just saying i'm just saying i'm just saying don't beat me up it's not a lie other people too i don't know what qualities they have that kind of have people gravitate towards them maybe they are charismatic maybe they're fine as fuck whatever it is that they have um people kind of gravitate towards them like magnus so people don't walk away from this person but you but you did <laughs> you got the fuck out of dodge he was like can i get an uber can i get a lift can i get a jet motherfucker can i get a boat can i get a yacht Get the fuck out of here. Get me out of here. That's what I heard, guys. I was like, oh, okay, okay, okay. We're going outside then. We're going outside. Wow. Zers. Wowzers. 
I don't feel sorry for this person. I have to be very honest though, okay? They did this to themselves. They really, really played with this, guys. They did. They honestly did not believe that it would ever come to this. This is going to be the shock of a lifetime. This, this do not disturb sign. For some of you, it's a totally new number. They can't find you. For some of you, you relocated. <laughs> You're gone, okay? Um, I feel like um, for those of you whose person is not experiencing this anxiety now, because they are conceited, they are um, arrogant, they are very egoistic. Um, so it's going to take them a while to figure out that you're no longer in the atmosphere, that you're no longer there. Oh, but when they do, oh, but when they do, when they figure out, guys, oh, 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 oh. They're gonna lose their shit, okay? Definitely dark night of the soul energy, lots of anxiety. That anxiety is gonna go through the fucking roof. Do you understand? These waves are gonna come in like nobody's business. Um, they're not gonna be able to catch one. They're not gonna be able to catch half of a wave, okay? Sorry about the noise. What happened this is what happens when you decide to record outside with the elements and every fucking thing else i have no control out here guys i'm just saying well, i can control my space unlike when i was in our quote unquote sky lounge i mean them kids was everywhere the people they nosy just coming in just to see what the fuck i'm doing i was like oh no 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 no. we can't have all of this nosy energy please no no no, no. it was feeling unwell within my soul so in any case, guys, I'm going to go ahead and pull one more and then we're going over to the extended to really, really dig in to see what's going on here with this person. OK, so how do they feel you've affected things? Let's see, <laughs> can't make it up. They were expecting you to contact them or come after them the same day shit ended, the same week shit ended, the same hour, right? They were definitely expecting it and they just kind of been holding on and waiting. Oof, when they find out that it's really a dub, I don't want to be there. I, I just, I don't want them to come back. I want to ban them from this energy because I feel like it will not be great. It will not be good. You know what I'm saying? You're like, it's not good now, girl. I'm just saying, I'm just saying. All right, guys, look, we're going over into the extended, okay? Over in the extended, I do want to see what does spirit have in store for this person in regards to karma. I do have a feeling that this is very much so a part of their karma, but I'm just going to double confirm it for us. We deserve to know. You know, we deserve to know. I also want to see what subconscious shadows um, have affected things in this connection drastically. That's going to be mirrored energy, so you'll be able to get something out of that as well as far as what shadow work you can do so that this never happens again. I also want to see what their next steps are going to be, the potential outcome, um, as well as their intentions, okay? We'll look at two potential outcomes. We'll look at the potential outcome if you decide to fuck with this again, no judgment here, or if you decide to go in the opposite direction. Um, I also intuitively felt the need to see um, what new things you have coming in. Overall, in love, finance, in life um only good what the spirit have in store for you in your next cycle we'll also take a look and see what blockages are keeping you from the next level of success um and how you can kind of work on those to to get to that next level to remove any stagnation that you've been experiencing i also want to see what's your next relationship looking like what's that looking like you know what i'm saying how soon can this shit happen how soon can you expect um union with your divine counterpart we'll also take a look at your finances a bit and then we'll get some focus advice from spirit in reference to what your focus needs to be for overall success in all aspects of your life in the least amount of time okay so come on over with me first click that like button now click the subscribe button and i will see you over in the extended let's cut up a little bit guys it's gonna be linked down below